13 consumer alert to warn you about. Stop right now and listen to what we're telling you. You need to know this before you use an ATM because that's exactly what scammers are using to get after your money and your information. Contact 13 investigative reporter Stephanie Zeppelin has the details. You probably heard about credit card skimmers, devices placed over the card reader to steal your card information. Forget the readers. According to a new study from a cybersecurity company, hackers are turning the whole ATM into a skimmer. The key is, how did they get access to these ATMs to get malware installed on them? Information technology expert Kurt Miller tells Action News these hackers are around the world and are getting inside your ATM. There are two ways of infecting computers. One is to try and hack through the firewall from the outside. That's the hard way. The easy way is to prey on the people that don't know the difference. It's like any email scam you may have heard of. He says the cyber criminals most likely send the bad virus through emails. So people inside the bank's networks open them, allowing the virus a direct path into the system and into the ATMs. They're preying on people not knowing the safety of what to click on and what not to click on. It's far easier to infect a facility from the inside than it is to try and hack in from the outside. The virus lets the hacker access the money or personal information of anyone who used the ATM. What's perhaps the scariest part about this new hack? These ATMs look just like any other one. It's impossible for you and I to tell which ones have been hit just from looking at them or using them. So how do you protect yourself? We have some expert tips for you on Action News Live at 6. Stephanie Zeppelin, 13 Action News. And don't forget, Contact 13's Call for Action is ready to help you with a consumer problem. Just call one of our volunteers any weekday between 11 a.m. and 1 p.m. at 702-368-2255.